Today we are doing a speed draft for the Jacksonville Jaguars, all seven rounds, PFF. And we should be done in under four minutes. The goal here is to get Lawrence some protection, some defense. We're going to go with no trades. So first we want to go with Evan Neal, obviously. Lawrence is the investment. You don't want him to get hurt. Then we pick here at 33. You don't want to go tackle again. So with DJ Tark leaving, you want to get Dotson. We don't pick two. So we got 65 and 70 back to back. We got a lot of picks in this area. At this point, it's Hmm. If Benito, I think Chanel is going to drop all the way to 70, so let's go Benito here. And he does, and then you take him, or Chanel. Might be less than four minutes. Oh, <clears throat> now, we want to go offensive line again. After you go wide receiver linebacker and pass rusher. Beef up the one. We got our next picks. Got a lot in the fifth, sixth, and seventh round. You already got you're already good at running back. D line's in need. I guess that's the best on the board, so you go Ridgeway. Next up, you don't really want to go safety here. And at tight end, you're very thin, so let's go Ferguson. Again, running back's high on the board, but you don't really need running back. So I'm going to go down. So you want to go defense here. Safety is pretty thin at this point. The Hawkins isn't a bad pick. Linebacker already taken. Edge already taken. D1 already taken. Cornerback. Very thin. So let's go Hawkins. Get 96 and 97 back to back. Let's go. Let's go with another need. Let's go OTAC. Off of the tackle here. Volson out of North Dakota is a project, but Jacksonville isn't going to win this year, so might as well take the risk. Isaiah Thomas is still here at Oklahoma. Just took Bonito, so it's probably a good idea here. And then we are up next at 218. Kramer's still here, which is probably our best bet. Yeah. The other ones are safeties or tackles. Let's go Kramer. Alright. It's a pretty solid draft to protect Lawrence and get him some weapons. Dawson's going to be huge for them. And especially going, I think I went 3-0 line, and you get the best offensive lineman in the draft. Got some defense. It's pretty solid. All right, next up, the Detroit Lions, probably coming out tomorrow. So, see you then.